Well, I'm truly grateful that I got the privilege of watching Liz grow uh, on the field. You know, we knew when she came in as a rookie, she was going to be a great center back. Took her a little bit of time to kind of earn that spot and have a couple of our, you know, legendary center backs, you know, move on. But, you know, the minute she stepped into that, you know, center back position, uh, she made number four a legendary number uh, and followed in the footsteps of a, a previous number four, which was incredible. Uh, but Liz has become not just a legit U Sports center back. In my opinion, she's the best center back in the country. Um, and she does that by the way she plays, but the way she carries herself on the field. Uh, she's got touch, she's got vision, she has toughness, she wins everything in the air, she's got pace, and boy, does she just regularly put in a consistent captain's performance. And speaking of that, it's been a delight to watch her become a captain. Uh, and she, you know, obviously took the reins as a captain during a very tough time when COVID first hit. And to watch, you know, her and her co-captain, Kristen, and now to be the captain this year in her sixth season, I've just watched her embrace being a leader. A uh, leader to the younger players, a leader to our culture, a leader to, in terms of how she plays on the field and commands such a respect and a presence, but also just the way that she has guided our program through some pretty tough waters, like, you know, every athlete has had to go through these last two years. So, Liz, I'm super proud of you. You have become an amazing servant to our program. Um, can't say enough about who you are as a person. Can't say enough about how much I respect you. Uh, you need to go play soccer at the next level because you are going to make it and you're going to have a bright career. But more than that, you're going to have a great future just because of who you are as a person.